So this tucks underneath here normally. This goes over and then you got the two screws that hold it in. And then this thing here. Normally it goes here. And I normally don't tighten this up very tight. I just hand tighten it. Because they can be hard to get off sometimes. And then this thing. Tucks under there. And I did have one that was tucked under there first and I couldn't get it out. I had to basically bend it. And then these screws. And then these two screws go on these sides here. It's good to have those screws because that belly pan, this pan here, can leak or warp. And we don't want that to happen. So we're going to put these screws on. And it should take one minute and this whole thing should fire up. And we're going to test it here real quick. And you should see the igniter glowing down here. Within one minute you should see a glow down there. Uh, within one minute that should fire up. If it takes longer than one minute there's something else wrong. And I just hand tighten those. You can see it's glowing in there now. And it should fire up it's like any second now. Yeah, there it is. Okay, you can hear it. So, it takes longer than a minute to fire up, then it's time to replace the igniter. It's easy as that. Yeah, it should shut off. Come oh, on, baby. It's shut off now. Okay.